I'm trying to film pollinating bumblebees amongst the purple clover and oxide daisies. But a certain pair think it's more important for me to be part of their play than film pollinating bumblebees. <laughs> Loads of little worker bumblebees were pollinating this area despite it being chilly after last night's rain and the storm off the west coast of Ireland and I was going to show the bumblebees at work but a certain pair has chased all the bumblebees away not you just your children you can see there's loads of purple clover and this here this is shepherd's purse the seed heads look like a purse a very old drawstring purse so and there's buttercups and there's speedwell you can see there's bits of speedwell there and some delicious grasses oxide daisies and these are the seed heads for cowslips which used to be so rare and endangered in Ireland it was illegal to pick them and now those two are running amok amongst the purple clover so the poor pollinators aren't getting half a chance because they're being bollocked about by puppies playing but it's very beautiful. The clovers and buttercups and speedwell and oxide daisies and grasses. So they're all over the place at the moment. Some people just like lying in them, chilling out, enjoying the cooler weather of last night's rain. Now, Okay, we're moving you guys. You ready for moving? Are you ready? Along here, you can see there's a lot of plantains are up and flowering. Oh, if you get under my feet, I'm going to step on you and trip. Here's um, salad burnet flowering with puppies all over it with their knobbly heads. These are the knobbly heads of the uh, salad burnet, a beautiful deep herb. A lot of buttercup, um, dandelions in here as well. This is St. John's wort. It's not flowering yet, but it will be. It's great for uh, dying fibers. And there, these are delicious to eat. This is vetch and you can eat the flower heads are delicious in your salad. They're very like peas. So really, really delicious and look beautiful in a fresh salad. So off to release the sheep into the paddock with loads of green stuff in it. The alpaca are still in there. Look at this. This is the beautiful hawthorn. So beautiful, their little flowers. And we have several varieties. I love the pink that you can see right there. It's so beautiful. Okay, the sheep are getting impatient to go through to the other gate. babies.
There's so much other good stuff in this field that they haven't needed to access the sheep's parsley that's up there on the edge of the wood. Down the field. Ah!